Hi, I'm Tim Tyler and this is a video of me eating a durian. So to start with, um, here is my durian. I'm wrapped up in Chinese newspaper. looks like. You can see it's very spiky. The spikes are there to protect it against um, small creatures which it doesn't want to be eaten by. If you only wants to be eaten by something that's large enough to take it home for lunch, um, and so transport its seeds around. So it's covered in spikes to protect it from other lesser creatures. is orangutans and other primates that can climb trees and are competent enough with their hands to get into the fortress that is the durian's outer skin. So I'm going to cheat a bit and use a knife to facilitate getting it in. Um, is like the vegan version of ice cream. Um, it's exceptionally delicious and gourmet fruit. So, um, it comes, it's a bit like um, a banana, but it's kind of divided up into segments naturally. So you can take out one of the segments. Looks like that. Uh, and then this is going to be the first time I've eaten a durian since I've had my big beard. So. We'll see how this goes. And there's a hint of the seed inside. Durian's probably my favourite fruit in the whole world. Or at least it's the fruit that I um, enjoy eating most. Um, it's kind of a hedonistic fruit. And you lose it at times of celebration. Makes you feel good. Makes you feel um, as though you're part of like, nature's harvest. And um, makes you feel as though you want to have sex as well. It's kind of um, pleasurable fruit to consume. One of the most addictive fruits in the world. Um, also quite expensive, so people um, often wind up um, with that as much money as they um, would like if they become too interested in the durian fruit. Um, this fruit cost me £19, which is quite a large number of dollars. So it's the fruit that's kind of tuned into your um, nervous system more than most other fruits. And because the, um, the animal that it wants to be distributed by is another great ape, basically, um, it kind of um, appeals to its nervous system as much as it can it's in competition with the other fruits of the forest in Borneo. So it has to do a good job of um, getting other creatures to distribute it. Durian's well known for its smell, which is designed to attract creatures from um, a long way around. And some people don't like it, but it's mainly um, disliked because it's a kind of pungent and invasive smell. 
and um, it's hard to concentrate on anything when there's a Dewey in around. So, first bit. of the durian, um, it's a fatty fruit, so it's a bit like an avocado in some respects, about 20% fat. It's probably not terribly good for you in terms of what it does to your blood sugar, because it's just like eating, well, you know, like eating ice cream, basically. But it's not too sweet, it's um, kind of a gourmet food, it has a delicate texture, and um, and described as tasting a bit like almonds and garlic, a mixture of almonds and garlic. So, um, there's some 